Against Hoosier rival Notre Dame, the nation's number one team at the time, the Boilermakers took the field between a long corridor of cord-wearing seniors who made an archway of their senior canes. Purdue won the coin toss, and the Boilermakers proceeded to march 67 yards in seven plays for the first score. Here, Jim Byrne picks up 40 yards on a pass from Mike Phipps. Seconds later, fullback Perry Williams bangs 10 yards for the first score to put Purdue ahead six to nothing. Still in the first quarter, the Irish fight back. Terry Hanratty scrambles out of containment and goes 26 yards to the Purdue one yard line. Hanratty scored on the next play to give the Irish a seven to six lead. Purdue's second touchdown was set up on this 34-yard pass from Phipps to senior halfback Bob Hurst, which carried to the Notre Dame three. Later in the game, Phipps threw to flanker Leroy Keyes for 11 yards to give Purdue a 21-14 lead. Protecting a lead of 28-21, Purdue's defense put the pressure on Hanratty, and Leroy Keyes made the Boilermakers' fourth interception, ending all Irish hope and giving the game to Purdue by a 28-21 count. 